Hi, we're at the Redbridge Cycling Centre and we're here to check out the new range of 2011 road bikes from White. So uh, my name's Ian Alexander and uh, just here at the White launch for the 2011 uh, uh, commuter bike and uh, city bike ranges. Uh, we've got a, a fast urban commuter range and then we've got a basically I suppose it can be described as a cross trail range of bikes which is uh, 700c uh, but very much more um, all-purpose uh, cross terrain style bikes. White is a, a mountain bike background um, it's, a, it's a, been a very high-end pure mountain bike brand for the past 10 years now and um, we've been looking at sort of the modern developments in um, Componentry, and I think we can do some really good um, contemporary urban bikes and commuter bikes now. So, uh, this bike's the Sterling, uh, it's uh, in the R7 series, and um, this is a fast urban commuter bike. Um, there's a lot of features on this bike. Again, you know, white's coming from a mountain bike background. We really, um, we really concentrate on geometry in uh, in mountain bike design, and that really is a, a fundamental part of the bike. And we've brought that across to, to this uh, to the urban range um, that we've done for 2011. The bikes are sort of borrowing really from the from the mountain bike style, um, the mountain bike geometry that we've we've developed over the years. So these bikes are slightly slacker. They're slightly longer in the frames and they're running slightly shorter stems so there's more of a mountain bike feel uh, to the geometry. Um, longer wheelbase, longer front centre, slightly more relaxed head angle so the bikes are, are more stable um, and they're, they're basically just handling it a little bit better uh, for the general sort of purpose urban commuting than, than say a, a normal road bike the geometry with, with a flat handlebar put on it. So um, details obviously hydraulic um, disc brake specific so um, very clean lines all the cable runs are neatly managed. Um, we've got a specific chainstay dropout uh, with the disc caliper integrated in post mount standard. Um, that basically allows the full sort of rack and mudguard uh, um, um, options without any hassles there. Um, again, disc specific carbon fork and um, really neatly managed cable runs across the whole whole of the frame. 